So you're thinking about moving to Plano, Texas, and you're curious about the best neighborhoods. Today we're out in the Windhaven area of Plano. The Windhaven area really has three subdivisions. You have Windhaven Farm, Castlemere, and Avignon Windhaven. One of the things that makes this area of Plano so special is the location. I'm actually right now in uh, Windhaven Meadows Park. It's a new park and it is truly a West Plano gem. The Windhaven Meadows Park is 123 acres. It's got lots of open space, about two miles of walking trails, and then it's got multiple kids areas and a huge dog park. And really, this is one of the things that I think differentiates Plano from other communities is its exceptional park system. So this area of Plano is really popular for families and it's a prime location. You're close to Dallas North Tollway, Legacy West, and you have great grocery stores, restaurants all nearby. I'll talk about amenities in a moment. First, let's hop into each of the neighborhoods. On the north side of Windhaven Parkway is Avignon Windhaven. Of the three subdivisions, this is the newer one. The first homes were built in 2006, and the neighborhood was finished in the mid-2010s. There are 243 homes in Avignon Windhaven. The first couple phases were built by custom builders. Toll Brothers later finished up the neighborhood. Now at the center of the neighborhood is this French country mansion, the Palais. It's a beautifully decorated clubhouse. It has outdoor pool, tennis, basketball, and gardens to enjoy. And it really kind of anchors the community. So when I think about Avignon Windhaven, I think of big houses, small lots. And what I mean by that is you have pretty substantial home sizes with modest backyards, modest side yards. So it makes for low maintenance living. Now, there are a handful of large lot homes in the neighborhood on the east side overlooking a greenbelt. One of the things, too, that makes this neighborhood unique is stucco. You just don't see a lot of homes with a stucco exterior in North Texas, and there are quite a few in this neighborhood. Though, as you look at architectural styles, it's predominantly a European and traditional style throughout the neighborhood. So you're probably going to pay a little more to live in Avignon Windhaven. Prices start in the 900s and go up into the low millions. So on the south side of Winhaven Parkway are Winhaven Farm and Castlemere, where we are now. Winhaven Farm has 472 homes, mostly built in the 90s by a variety of custom builders and really semi-custom homes. You'll see some floor plans repeating throughout. And then Castlemere has 247 homes, also built in the 90s. Both of these neighborhoods are pretty homogenous in their look and feel, though they are separate subdivisions. You also find that they have pretty similar price points here. You can get in these neighborhoods in the 800s into the millions. As you go next to Winhaven Park though, you will pay a premium to be by the park. So one of the awesome things about living in Winhaven Farm in Castlemere is the proximity to the West Plano school zone. You have Brinker Elementary, Renner Middle School, and West Plano High School all in walking distance. So for most of their childhood, your kids are gonna be able to walk to school. I would think about all of these neighborhoods as million dollar neighborhoods. Sure, you can get into them now for a little under a million, but what makes them special is their location. They just have a great location. On the west side, you have amazing amenities. You've got Chewy's, one of my favorite spots, and some other great restaurants too, like Ford's Garage, Papa Delta Blues. You can cruise over to Cinemark, or you can grab and go at Eatsy's bakery and marketplace. And then you're right next to Dallas North Tollway, so you get anywhere fast. And then on the east side, you have Windhaven Meadows Park, where we started. And then you also have east of that, Lakeside at Preston, which is both a neighborhood and a great retail area. That's where you'll find the new HEB. You'll also find some Plano staples like Kenny's Burgers, Craftway, Beerhead, or grab an ice cream cone at local creamery. You're just surrounded by great amenities here in the Windhaven area. So the Windhaven area is growing. East of Avignon Windhaven is Outlook at Windhaven, a active retirement community probably completed in 2024. And then south of Spring Creek, there's a master plan for the Haggard Farm that we'll see take fruition over the next couple years. So that's the Windhaven area of West Plano, an exceptional location with top tier subdivisions. If you wanna learn more about living in Plano or North Texas, check out this playlist. We'll see you in the next video.